Okay guys, here's a new one. Today, on this episode, we're going to embark on an artistic adventure of making a chair, not so just chair-like, but in fact, we're going to put on our artist shades, or hats, whatever you want to wear as an artist. I'm your shades, yeah. Ooh, gosh, look at this hair, it's crazy today. But we're not drawing something crazy, we are drawing something charming. So in this episode, we're gonna be creating a charming, huh? huh? A charming chair. So grab something to draw with and something to color with and let's make some art. This episode is brought to you by ArtasticKids.com. If you're a parent, guardian, homeschool family, or a classroom teacher looking for art lessons and resources, begin your journey by finding free art lessons, tips, advice, and more at ArtasticKids.com. All right, we are doing a charming chair. A charming chair, yes, a charming chair. All right, let's open it real quick. All right, we're gonna do it on a three quarter. So we're gonna draw one. Uh, diagonal line, that's what it's called, diagonal line, and then one line up, and one in the back. Let me just switch markers. There we go. Okay, one line in the front, one line in the back, and then we'll connect them with another diagonal line. So it's kind of like a diamond, but the back is smaller than the front to make this look farther away. That's the idea. Okay. Two lines up. Bringing this one a little higher. Okay, now on the inside, we're gonna draw two more lines, nice and straight as best you can. We'll draw a knob on the top. And then connect and make a back for it with a curving line on the top and bottom. Okay, on the front here, we're gonna draw three lines down, smaller lines down. And then we're gonna connect with another straight line that is parallel to the line above it. So this line is parallel to this line and that line. And this line is parallel to this line, this line, and that line. See, math. Yes, there's math and art, guys. Woo! I know, right? All right, here we go. Draw some chair legs. Two back ones a little shorter so they appear farther away and there's a fourth one and we'll have it peeking out right here and it's gonna be the smallest because it's even farther all right so we got the chair part done so i'm gonna add some hatching lines on the ground here for some shade remember hatching lines have sound effects and it goes like this I mean hatching lines. Okay, we got our hatching lines there. I really need to fix this, it's bothering me. Oh, that's so much better. All right, so now I gotta decide about where my face is going. So I think I'm gonna do my face here, here. I'm gonna do it on here, here, here. Now, if I put the face here, then something's gonna sit on its face. That would be so sad. Okay, I'm gonna put it right here. One circle on one side, one circle on the other. In each circle, a smaller circle, and then I'm gonna color in that darker of those eyes, leaving just those little circles white. Between the eyes, a straight line, and then connect just that with the letter U. And from one corner down to the bottom, we're gonna draw a curving line, and then color in the dark of the mouth, leaving just that tongue nice and white. So cute! Okay, but it's charming. Some beautiful little charming stars because it's like oh, I'm a beautiful chair. Oops, I messed that one up. Ugh. Okay, this is, Don't get everything right every time. Okay. And it's like super shiny, so we'll draw some like shiny spots on it. That's some curving lines. 
And then everything's like magical. So there's like hearts exploding everywhere. Like, oh my gosh, I'm such a nice, kind, beautiful chair, guys. I'm just so charming. Oh my gosh, look at me. I'm a charming chair. Oh yeah, we get some charming, shiny spots on the knobbies. Spot there, and we can go and add some hatching lines on this chair here for some shading. And on the legs, oh my gosh, I'm so charming. Okay, maybe these are like oh, they're like so shiny, they're like listening in the sunlight. Oh my gosh, it's so amazing. Oh my gosh, look at this beautiful, charming chair. Oh my gosh, guys. Okay, there we go. doing the drawing part of your charming chair. Take your favorite colors and go ahead and color in your most charming chair ever. Once you're done coloring in your charming chair, your charming chair is done.